All right, let's do new releases. Okay. Fantastic. I've been playing a new release. Which one? I've been playing a little bit of Just Cause 4. Did you did you buy that? I, I did. That's crazy. Why? You're the only person I know who bought that game, so that's why I'm surprised. It was a uh, $10 reward certificate uh, game at Best Buy. It was. I missed that one. Yes, it was. Or maybe I didn't miss that one. Too late Correct. now. Yeah, I've heard mixed Something. things. I heard it's pretty janky. It's... So... Spider-Man came out this year, right? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, it, it's impossible if you played Spider-Man. Uh, and this is no fault of just causes. Right. It's just like that Spider-Man was so good and the mechanics were so easy and fluid. And then now Just Cause is here. And the first time you shoot out the grappling hook, you're like, oh, I remember Spider-Man's webs. <laughs> Those are better. Right. <laughs> Those are way better. And right. also like, he's like a superhero and can right. basically fly. Yeah. Um but it's still and it's definitely it's not a top tier game. It it well, it's they're got selling some, it for a top tier price. No, they're playing they're selling it for the, the price of a video game. <laughs> <laughs> um it's not bad. It's just, it takes you back a little bit to, I don't know, like, it feels like you're playing Saints Row or something. Like, it's it's just not all fluid and everything. But it's still fun, because it's still fun to screw around and attach balloons to things and grenades and blow up guys and um, do all that stuff. It's It's just, it's not all put together very in a very interesting package i would say the the character models they're just kind of stiff um i want to play more of it because i haven't even gotten to the point where there's like the giant tornadoes and stuff like that's the new feature to this wait wombat's cheating and he's looking at the switch games ahead of time no i'm Mm. not yes you are i I see your cursor is down there yes don't scroll down sorry i wasn't reading that you could scroll down sorry also, I have a camera set up in your room. Wow. I'm watching you. Seriously, <laughs> relax, dude. I actually was grabbing. So I, uh, I actually wasn't even looking at my screen, but it's neither here nor there. Are you watching the game awards? No. <laughs> what? I don't even want to know. I had something yeah. stuck in my teeth, and I went to go get something to st- unstick it. See, mm. I said I didn't want to know. Now you know. But anyway, go on. You were talking about just cause and tornadoes. Yeah, I haven't seen the tornadoes yet. It's hinted at them, but I, I'm really only like maybe an hour, hour and a half in. Mm-hmm. Um, but I, it just feels, it feels like something you've played before is, it's the right, best way to, but not to describe quite it. as good. Um, well, no, it, it feels like you, you've played Just Cause 2 before and right. this is kind of it. And you're like, wow, we, we made it to Just Cause 4. Like this is a franchise that we've we've made it to just cause four and they haven't even like slapped on a, like a subtitle or anything. It's just, just cause four. Here it is. Um, right. Like I said, it's still, it's still funny because it's funny to be like in a high speed chase and attaching balloons to the, the motorcycles that are trying to, to shoot you and, and watching what happens there or, accidentally attaching them to the truck that you're in and then having to deal with like kind of you getting flipped around and floating in the air while you're trying to shoot other people like all that stuff's still fun and it's sandboxy it's just maybe maybe the like structure of the game doesn't need to be okay let's go do this mission and get these squads and expand your like the map I don't know. I don't know what to do to fix Just Cause 4 or make it better. It's just kind of, here's this game again. Right. You need to turn that into a superhero game. I mean, you essentially are. Right. Right? It's just, I mean, you can do the wingsuit. You can do the parachute. You're basically uh, Batman. You, with guns. you can get shot by a lot of bullets or rocket launchers and you're you're all right. Like, it's not, it's not like it's an over, overly difficult game or anything, but... It's just yeah, it's missing the magic. Um, yeah, but 
I don't know. I believe it. Maybe maybe when the tornado comes, I'll <laughs> you'll I'll let us be blown away. Say, yeah, literally. You'll be sucked in. You mean? Mm-hmm. All of these things. Mm. All right. Anything? Oh, Subnautica came out this week. Yeah, you've been, you've been playing that for a long time. I guess it's. Well, I haven't played it recently. I know, but, but it's, it's out of very... early access now. You should check it out and see if it's any different. Um, I was playing on PC. I think. Okay. Yes, I am. It's it's good. I just mm-hmm. you know sometimes you don't feel like. Playing something where you can drown, you're always in danger of drowning. You know, you feel like suffocated. You know what I mean? I do know what you mean. I was nodding my head as if people could see me. Yep, I understand. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what else we got this week? You know what's not on the list, but came no. out this week and I'm playing it, is Mutant Year Zero. Oh, okay. You're playing that? It came out on to uh, Game good? Pass on release day. Okay. And that game is pretty good. It is a uh, a turn-based strategy game. Think like XCOM. Mm-hmm. Where you play as these three mute mutants. One is like a duck person. One is a boar person. And the other is a lady person. You are a boar person. I am a boar person. And, you know, it's, it's pretty classic, you know, uh, turn-based XCOM style gameplay. But there's also, in between that... You're you're controlling your character, you know, free freehand, freestyle, and you're exploring the landscape and looking for gear to pick up and loot and things to sell. So it's got like this combination, almost like a Diablo style wandering around, but the combat is all this turn based stuff. Yeah, I watched the video of it on IGN. It actually looked pretty good. It is, it's not bad. Night. I mean, you know, if you have Game Pass, you already paid for it. So you might as well check it out. Sounds good. Mm-hmm. Strange Brigade Brigade also came to Game Pass today for those who don't have that game yet. Oh, wow. So that game is great. And if you have Game Pass again, you've already paid for it. So You have to play it. You have to play it. It's the law. Well, it's just kind of yeah, like Mutant Zero yeah. is one of those games where, uh, whatever, Mutant Year Zero. I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll play that because... It's free. <laughs> it's free. It's basically free to me. 